Now, here's the mistake a lot of agency owners make is they look for opportunities too quick. So I'm actually driving to a meeting today. I'm wearing pants. I'm actually presentable or semi-presentable and going to meet with an agency. And we're actually going to talk about a particular software that we're working on uh, for agencies that I'm excited about. And the point being is, is you should always be looking for other opportunities um, in other areas, not just your primary business. Now, here's the mistake a lot of agency owners make is they look for opportunities too quick. Like for example, you don't have the agency systems in place, right? You don't have the agency systems in place to grow and scale your agency currently. And you're looking for other opportunities and other business models that you can do, which is a big distraction. You should only do it once your agency is streamlined and it's working like a clock, like it's, you know, just rocking and rolling. And then you can start looking for those oppor other opportunities in order to grow um, in other areas. But I think the biggest mistake people make is they look for new opportunities too quick. And then they just don't know where to dedicate the time because we can't create more time. If you can create more time, contact me and we'll see what we can actually <laughs> market. We'll be very, very, very um, well known uh, as well if we can do that. But I just don't want you guys to get distracted. Um, but once you feel that you're in a place where you could go on vacation for two weeks, you can go on vacation for a month from your agency, I think that's the, the sign of when you should start really be on the lookout for new opportunities that you can grow and to scale if that's something that you want to do um, and use your agency as almost an incubator. Now, here's the other mistake that people make, especially within the, their own agency, is they put the same team on, uh, you know, the, the, the new project, the new company. You need to separate it because, look, we did this as well, right? We were one of the first to build a content management system. Hell, we were one of the first to build an email marketing system in 2001. And um, we just never had time in order to keep that up to date, right? I mean, we did this before MailChimp was around, um, but we never had time to keep that up to date because the client work was always coming in and they came first. And so you got to separate that team. So I just wanted to give you a couple little pointers, a little kind of car rant, I guess, the agency car rant, Swank Today car rant, and um, hopefully that gives you guys some help. Um, what I'd like to hear is make sure you comment below. Let me know if you've been distracted by some of the opportunities. Um, let me know if, if you have any opportunities that, you know, your agency is streamlined. I don't want to distract you from your agency, but if you have a particular software that you would like to develop for your own agency to help streamline it, where you think it would benefit other agencies, and you want to possibly partner in a new venture where um, you know we'll uh, market it to my audience. Let me know. Hit me up. Uh, you know, email me. You guys all know my email address. It's the same email address I blast you every week with on the Agency Insights. And then the other thing I want to tell you guys about February eighth and 9th, um, I'm having a live event in Atlanta. It's a two day live event, small group, where uh, you get to work directly with me and ask me questions and we can focus on your business and really take it to the next level for 2018. If you wanna know more about that, go to jasonswank.com slash workshop and I will chat with you guys soon. Have a swank day.